there is a lot of eagerness by a group in Ramnagara district of southern Karnataka to put up a large statue of Jesus made up of scrap granite from the area in a place which has seen Christian worshippers for centuries now. But that does seem to be going slow at this moment. Joining us is Mr. Chinaraj, a parishioner of the area. This statue has been planned for a long time and you've got all the paperwork, you've got all the necessary paperwork, all the documents are here? Or, uh... No, see the statue, it's not planned now. The statue was already there, already there. Okay. for centuries together. Okay. People used to go especially on Good Fridays. Good Friday, that is a day when Jesus was crucified. Symbolizing that, we call that as Kapala Betta. Mm -hmm. See, it is, in the Bible, it is said it's Calvary. 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 But in Canada, also scriptures mm -hmm. and in the Bible, it is said Kapala Betta. Kapala. So we call it as Kapala Betta, symbolizing that Calvary Hill. Worship here yes. has been going on for, uh, as long, I yes, mean, for yes, a yes, very yes, long yes, time. Yes. And uh, uh, recently, Almost uh, four years back, when we re we requested Mr. D K Shukumar sir, being our uh, local MLA there, to come over there for prayers. Mm -hmm. So he came there and he inquired us, how come, how we, uh, where you got this land, whose land, all these things. He just said, so it is uh, government land only, we, we, but being used for a uh, centuries together, we are just doing it, and we want to renovate this statue, what is existing there, and also to plan something new there. You no. Know? Then, he, and then when we said it's a government land, he should back. No, you cannot do it in a government land. He advised us, you cannot do that in a government land. You better apply to the government, get it sanctioned, get it sanctioned for such purpose, particular purpose, and then go ahead with your work. So immediately we stopped the work there. Okay. okay. And we went ahead giving applications to the government and all. In, to be honest, we almost uh, 15 years, 20 years back only, we had made a representation for okay. to grant us around yes. 20, 60 acres. For this so that purpose, for, for, the, for this purpose. For upgrading. So it, it was stalled that time also. And this time when sir said not to go ahead without proper documents, we stopped it. Yes. And then we made a representation to all the officers, including the local MLA, our, uh, he was a minister also that time, Mr. D.K. Shukumar sir, and revenue minister, Mr. Kaguru Timappa. Yes and also to Chief Minister, Mr. Sudramaya also. So, they inquired us for what all the purposes, they wanted a uh, complete project report on that. So, we prepared a project report also. We said that we are planning to renovate the statue, what is existing there, and also to put up a new statue. So, accordingly, permission was granted in the so cabinet. Permission was granted by the cabinet, all the paperwork yes. was yes. done, yes. everything was done. Yeah. How long will it take? What stage is the... It, what stage so is the project in now? See, it is in the initial stages only. We called Shukuma sir on 25th of Christmas. So he said, being Christmas, no, that is the only village where majority of Christians are staying. So he, he feels happy to come over to our place of being there with us for a Christmas celebrations. So he actually came there okay. and we got used that, you know, we wanted to make use of that chance when he is coming to make small puja there. So that was only puja done on that okay. day. So the project will take us almost five years time. Five years time. Five years time. Okay. And to take uh, all the uh, start, uh, erection also will take at least two years time. S to start the erections. To start, to even begin work, it will take about, the physical no, no, work. The erections, I'm the telling erection, you, yeah. maybe sculpture work, all that designing things but and all will take now. But it will be another two years. Two years, it will start okay. for erections of the statue. Okay. And what about the funding? How much do you think it will cost and where is the funding coming from? Funding, funding, you see what we have done, that's a small Christian village. Uh, we we all called together, we made a meeting also with the parish priest there. Everybody said, okay, we'll, one house will contribute to one lakh. Okay. Each house will contribute one lakh. So, and uh, we were, uh, we are, almost 3,000 population is there in that. Almost 700 families are also there. We thought, at least seven crores is confirmed for us. Then we thought, we'll go out. So many Christian people are there, so many, you know, well wishers are there. Uh, surrounding our village, it's completely Hindu village, but all are very good friends. Friend, friend. They all come for prayers there. They, they'll be with us on Good Friday and yeah, Christmas celebrations and all. We thought we can mobilize. So the initial fund will be almost 5-6 crores. Yeah. That will be from the local village. Okay. And the rest we can make it out from the other uh, well-wishers. Uh, and uh, some other uh, outside Bangalore people are there who will be ready and to contribute. What about acquiring the government land? Mr. D.K. Shiv Kumar helped with the funding for yes. actually acquiring that land? Yeah, see when he advised us about going for the approach in the government to get the land, 
then we when when we were uh, issued with a notice also to pay 22 lakhs for this after cabinet approval then we approached him actually we asked we said see 22 lakhs is too much for us so can you just contribute yeah. then he said see 22 lakhs is too much i also agree you just make one more application to the government mm. so whatever they reduce yeah. then for that amount i'll try to contribute myself so he paid his personal funds personal funds to help the to transfer, the lands, transfer, transfer the lands to transfer the lands to transfer the lands yes he made it now has there been any opposition to this project from the bjp state government or from the bjp groups do you feel confident that this project will go ahead madam to be very honest kanakpura taluk or the ramnagar district itself all brothers there other uh, uh, non christian people they are very supportive they are not against this issue it is only an issue created by some people outside the ramnagar district and some who are intentionally against the statue against mr dikeshu kumar sir all these things as paid up for them they are trying to create a uh, issue there there is no issue at all there all are very cooperative localites are really supporting us to do the statue they all come for prayers with us there are, are you going ahead right now or are you concerned that there may be some other issues some other legal problems or are you going ahead are you confident no we are very confident government will also we be very supportive to us maybe one or two people are talking against it maybe we are very confident our chief minister or the government present government they too will not uh, object the statue work or uh, uh, going ahead ahead with the statue work we are very confident the government will support us so is the work on hold or are you going ahead right now work is on hold because we thought it, it we should not keep on doing when things are going on against us you know let everything settle down we st will start it and also the labors who are working there only we engage around 5 6 people there they have gone back to tamil nadu they have got pongal 14th so they want to complete that festival and come back uh, by then all other issues also will be settled we plan to start immediately after once they come back so we are very confident we'll go ahead with the yeah we are, we will be allowed to uh, complete the project that is not against any religion it is only a and uh, uh, it's a, a matter of uh, pride that something new is coming up so everybody will uh, support us that's what we think. so parishioners of kapala beta confident that they will be able to erect their dream project a large statue of jesus in ramnagara district with dm kumar maya sharma for indi tv